In this video tutorial, we're going to discuss about the aspects of a circle, such as the center, the radius, the diameter. So let's first answer this question. What is the center and the radius of a circle? Over here, you have a picture of your circle. And letter A, or point A, is called the center of the circle, which is the middle of your circle. Now, points C and point B and point T, those three points are on the circle. The radius of a circle is the distance from the center to any point on the circle. So if I start at center A and I extend all the way to point B, that length is called the radius. If I start again at point A, the center of the circle, extending all the way to point T, that length is also called the radius. If I start again at the center of the circle, point A, and extend all the way over to point C, that length is also called the radius. The radius is also half the length of the diameter. Let's talk about diameter. What is the diameter of a circle? In this picture, you have B, which is on the circle, C, which is also on the circle, letter A still represents the middle of our circle. Now, a diameter of a circle is the distance from one point on a circle through the center to another point on the circle, such as if I start at point B and I extend through the middle of my circle, point A, continuing to extend to the other side of the circle and ending at point C, this length, line segment BC, is called a diameter. The diameter also represents the longest distance across the circle. And lastly, the diameter is twice the length of the radius. We previously identified that line segment AB is a radius. Same thing as line segment a, C. So the diameter CB is double the radius.